Crazy Carp TV, episode 6, down at Wesson's uh, Fisher again. Um, this time we're on Big Tench, we have a match on um, Middle, Full Lake. So we decided to come in this corner. Um, me and Danny are fishing next to each other, he's on peg 24, I'm on peg 25. Got two rods out each. Um, the wind's blowing into our side of the lake, so it's looking quite good. Um, I'll let Danny show you the spots in a minute. Uh, so I thought I would keep you updated and we'll start vlogging. Um, show, show you all the rigs, setups, as always. Um, any fish you can catch them. Time to talk through the spots. My first spot is on the right hand side with them um, gorillas. Um, I put it there because I found a quite a nice deep spot. Um, so, so I thought cold weather might go a bit deeper in the column water. Also the wind's blowing in. So I thought it's a new wind so I thought the fish might be following it. My second spot is the opposite side of the lake. And that gray is where, where it used those green green ones. Um, again, found a little bit of a deep spot. I pulled it off for about I don't know about two foot. A little ledge. Pulled it back. Um, I went round and a few full uh, like handful of boilers in. Nothing too much, but it's still cold. So that that's a spot. And I've also got a spot. Keep trickling bait in, so if nothing's working later on, in that corner, there's a bit of a slick, I don't know if you'll see it on the camera. So I thought if nothing else is working, I'll see if there's a wiggle one out of there. Um, Danny's rods, he's got one on the tree, the other one in the tree. Again, he's going to the same approach to me, on a bit of deeper water, slack water. Band in the middle of there, and there's other ones on the rears, not too far away from mine. Really, it's about, I don't know, about 15 20 foot away. Um, and the same reason again, we have to go for deeper water to try and try and waggle one out. Um, cold conditions again. If you could feel my toes, you'd know how cold it is. They are so cold. Um, Log two. Um, it is now ten to twelve, twelve o'clock. Five to twelve. Five to twelve. Um, don't add anything. I had a take on my right hand rod. Donny had a bit of a pick. Up. Keep getting little pick ups. Um, we both recasted. I've moved my left hand rod to where I showed you where I've been bitten up. Um, looking a bit better in there now. I uh, thought, thought nothing else is working so I'll try it. Nobody else has caught on the lake. It's only a small lake. Best time um, on the lake as well. We've been told, we don't know if it's true, but there's a 32 um, pound nearer in here. Um, and quite a few 20s which we don't know if it's true. We can't see it being true, it's only a small lake. Um, but hopefully if it is, we could have one of them on the bank. Uh, we just need to explain that uh, in the first vlog, James said it was Tinch Lake. And that's just the name. It is actually more or less a carp lake, but the name of it is just Tinch. So don't get worried that uh, the crazy carp is turned into the crazy Tenches. <laughs> um, Alex caught his PB out of here. Um, that mirror that you can see on the website, 16 Summit, I think it is. Um, opposite side of the lake, that's where we're fishing. 
Bury Cottage from. Um, that was last year, I think. Year before. Alex hasn't done that much fishing this year. Hopefully he'll get his uh, head right and start start getting on the bank a bit more. Um, Harry, you'll see a few more videos from him, hopefully. With his stables trips. There'll be a big write-up on him. Um, articles, etc. On the stables. Um, still freezing cold. Blue skies. Yeah. Sun's out, but it's cold, so we haven't got much bait. So been trickling it in little and often, little and often. Um, probably like two, three, four boilers at a time. Every couple of hours, every hour or so. Just try and keep the swim moving. Because it is cold, so. It was also a really cold night last night. Um, so the fish will have dropped. Yeah, where are they? Uh, we only found out, because I was talking to talking to a few people and we got here. They're, uh, the lake bed is actually shallower up this end where we are. So uh, we're not where we wanted to be really. Mm. We only found out after we'd started fishing that it's the side was shallower. Oh, again, but, uh, the sun's on the water. Hopefully it might warm it up a degree or two. But I can't, I can't see get can't see us getting a lot of fish really. But uh, hopefully we'll have we'll one or two. We'll do well to get one or two. There's some Quite good anglers on this lake. Um, and like I say, they've had nothing. They're not getting knocks or anything. And we're getting a few pickups, etc. But um, the, the match on the middle lake is um, meant to finish at three. We're getting picked up at four, but uh, might sneak round there and see if Danny again can sneak one out from his favourite place. I might do that. Um, baits that we're using, what bait are you using? I'm using, uh, as, as always, steamer. Steamer baits sell 18mm and 15mm. And um, I've got a 10mm fruit teller and 15mm fruit teller. I've got a 15mm pop up rig on it, that's fruit teller. And then I've got a KD snowman with 18mm um, cell with a 10mm fruit teller pop up. I'm using it. Um, one on the snow mat, well both got snowmen on, um, as you always see me using. But uh there you go, got, got a knock. Uh, I had to look around the camera then because uh, the camera's actually balanced on my rods. So uh, but uh, yeah, snowmen, but one of them's got a mulberry pop up on. Um, and one of them's got my secret bait, which I uh, can't tell you yet. So we're gonna see if it produces well. Season, then I might tell you next season, maybe. We're feeling nice. I don't even know what it is yet. He's uh, giving me hints, but he won't tell me what it is. So I've got it on one rod, and I've got it on the rod that just had that little pick up. He won't even, he won't even show me yet. So no, not yet. It is secret. Right then, uh, that's vlog two. We'll do another vlog for Olga, probably. Uh, show you our fish if we have any fish. And, uh, See how it goes. See you later. Show you the, yeah. Show you the lake from my swim. So that's where the camera was there. And that's the lake. A few people on fishing. As James said, I've just got one rod out there. One rod out there. James is fishing there. And he's moving his rod to there. 